one two pitch. Breaking ball, hit to right field, could be trouble if it gets on that wall, and he does. Trahan gets waved around third. He's going to score without a throw, and the Raging Cajuns take a 1 0 lead on the RBI double by Gerard. 27th RBI of the season for Tyler Gerard. And his fourth RBI of this tournament. And watch where this pitch is here. He throws a breaking ball. He threw him four breaking balls. Three of them were low and away, and he got him to whiff at two of those. And then he makes a mistake and leaves that breaking ball hanging. Gerard turns it around for a double and an RBI. So one two pitch. That ball is hit deep left field. Let's see if the ballpark holds it right at the fence. Stuttered makes the play. Trostclair will tag from third, and it's 2 0. Powell gave it a ride, a long, noisy out, but a sacrifice fly, and the Cajuns double their lead. Breakfast with the Pius family. 0 2 pitch hit hard to the third baseman. That might be another double play, and it is. How about that? Marks has surrendered three singles, or rather, two singles and a walk in this game, and in those three occasions, he's erased him with double plays. Pitcher's best friend, and it's kind of tailor-made there as it's hit hard to Robin. Seventh and leading to nothing. Trey Han into right field, base hit off the glove of Valeris. Davis scores, and Louisiana has a 3-0 lead. Just off the glove, the tip of the glove of Valeris, and into right field for a second hit today for Trey Han. And that's the second time we've seen him go to right field on that. Again, great piece of hitting. That ball, that was a great pitch, actually, low and away. He's able to reach down and just hit it hard into right field, just off the glove of Valeris at second base. And you 0-2 pitch. Wow. Parks strikes out Hill for a third time, elevated the fastball. 3-2. Breaking ball called strike three. Eight strikeouts. Let's try to take yourself out of a double play situation. Oh, snagged right out of the air. Super defensive play by McElroy. Just robbed the Raging Cajuns of another run because that's down in the corner. And Trostclair would have scored easily. Well, McElroy at six foot three needed, needed all of that and a vertical to be able to get up and, and get that one. Nice play by the first baseman. Weekend. Here's the 2-2 pitch, chase the breaking ball. Greg Davis goes down on strikes. Into left field, Stutter charges, and did he make the play? He did. Granger stuttered, sliding and making the grab to rob Nick Thurman here in the ninth. Another nice play in left field here. He kind of looks like he hesitated a bit and timed it up perfectly and a nice play able to grab that just before it's Hits the ground, another nice play in left field. In the air, and that should do it. Clement has it. Cajuns get to play the Bobcats again in one hour and 15 minutes. How about the performance by Wyatt Marks, seven shutout innings as the Raging Cajuns blank the Bobcats 3-0. They will play an elimination semifinal coming up at 4.30 Central Time.